Hey guys, so to start off with, I will wash my face with the Cleanse and Polish Hot Cloth Cleanser by Liz Earl, followed by the Skin Repair Moisturiser. Then to prime my face, I will be using Benefits The Pore Professional Pro Balm to minimise the appearance of pores, uh, followed by the Instant Anti-Age Eraser Eye Perfecting Concealer to cover up any dark circles before applying any eyeshadow. Then just blending this out with the Real Techniques Sculpting Brush um, and applying Fawn from the Lorac Pro Palette to lock it all in place. Just taking a small piece of tape and lining that from the outer corner of my eye to the end of my eyebrow, this will just give the eyeshadow look a really clean and crisp line um, once, once you've removed it away. Taking the colour stone, I am going to start defining my crease and also building up some colour in the outer corner. Taking the colour black, I am now going to start building up the colour in the outer corner of my eye and bringing it into the centre portion of my eye. To build up that definition in the outer corner of my eye, I'm going to take the colour caviar um, and start packing that in there. On a large blending brush, I'm going to take the colour caramel and start blending those edges away so they're not too sharp. I'm just going to lighten those inner corners up, so I'm going to be using the colour vanilla and I'll be using those on the inner portion of my eye and take them out a little bit to the um, inner section of my eye. Okay, so now that the majority of my eye is finished, I will be moving on to foundation. I am using Clinique's Beyond Perfecting Foundation in the shade 1 Linen. To highlight under my eyes, down the bridge of my nose, um, forehead and chin, I will be taking NARS's Creamy Concealer in the shade Light One Chantilly.
to set the concealer under my eyes, I will be using Vici's Derma Blend in the shade Translucent. While I leave my concealer to set, I will be finishing up the rest of my face, starting with contouring. I am using Benefit's Hoola Bronzer. And it doesn't have a shade because that's the shade. <laughs> Now moving on to eyebrows, I'm just going to brush them through with the spoolie um, and then I'm going to use the L'Oreal Brow Shaper in the shade 04 Dark Brunette. I'm going to just start outlining my eyebrows and filling in the outer sections of my eyebrows. To fill in the inner corners of my eyebrows, I will be taking the number 7 Beautiful Eyebrow Kit and using the two shades um, with an angled brush to fill in the inner corners of my eyebrows. Now that I've finished my eyebrows, I'm going to dust away the translucent powder with a large brush and move on to blush. I am now going to finish up my eyes. I'm going to take the colour stone on a flat brush and I'm going to apply this underneath my lash line. Once I have done this, I'm going to add a pair of lashes, line my waterline with a black eye pencil and apply the Gosh lipstick in the colour 001 Matte Baby Lips.
Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!